Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Yulisa. I own a notary business and I help notaries across the nation to escalate their business. In today's video, I'm going to give you an update on how the market has been recently on what my personal business is, how it's doing and just a little update of everything. So if you're interested, please keep watching. I've been asked a lot recently to post an update on how the business has been, how it's going, um, just an update on everything. And so this is your update. The very first thing that I want to say, and I'm so excited, is I am going back full time to being a notary public. I am just ready to go back to it full time and just full force and just implement everything that I've learned this last couple of months. I am so excited. I feel like it was it was a nice break from I was just really mentally drained from trying to market like crazy. I think I needed a break to be able to implement things right and learn better strategies, better ways to market. Like you never stop learning and you always have to continue to educate yourself in the field that you you are in but also as you advertise your business. And I feel like I just needed to step away from it and just kind of redirect my business because that's what I've done. For the longest time, it was so hard. When I started assigning service, it was really hard for me to start assigning service because I felt like if I started assigning service, my clients were gonna think that I didn't have time for them. They were going to get their signings away somewhere else or they were just simply going to take their signings themselves. And so it was such a hard battle within myself to be able to start a signing service. And I, when I started my signing service, I was only giving out signings outside of the county, like outside from my, where I just couldn't go to. And so I just, I just made sure that I built a strong relationship with them to the point where re we're really good friends. I'm really good friends with all of my clients and I love them and they love me. We mutually love each other. And so it just got to a point where I understood, okay, our relationship is strong enough where I can let them know, hey, I have a signing service now because my business is growing thanks to you. And I just want to give you a better service. I, you know, just let them know about what it entails and, and let them know like give them the insights give them everything and that's that's how i slowly was able to start growing my signing service so now my signing service is 50 percent of my business which is totally surreal i always thought i wasn't going to be able to really grow a signing service because of that mentality and you have to when you want to grow a business and i'm not saying like you have to go and create a signing service but it did get to a point for me where it was very over overwhelming um that i could not say no i didn't want to say no to a signing because then i felt they weren't going to give me the next signing and i felt overwhelmed because i just i was burned out i was taking eight signings in a day eight signings plus printing plus driving plus scanning plus the administrative work that was like 16 hours of work my full day was just work. I was breathing, eating, living work. And I love it so much that it really doesn't feel like work. But I'm like, okay, I'm burned out. Something has to change. Um, and I obviously do not want to start saying no to a bunch of signings. So what can I do so that my clients feel like I'm taking care of them, but I'm also taking care of my health? Because if you're burned out, your health is in the line. And that's when I started my signing service. Now, um, I do have a lot of clients that use my signing services and it's just truly amazing. I have the ability to give signings to other notaries, but also still help my clients and know that they're taken care of because I'm overseeing the entire transaction. I'm overseeing the signing. With that being said, I'm going back full time because not only has my business escalated within the last couple of months, um, early 2023 was a little bit challenging. It was a little bit slow. Um, not necessarily, I mean, it was slow 
the market was slower, interest rates were just rising, a lot of title companies were keeping the work so they didn't have to have an extra expense. And that's what I started noticing a lot. And that's where I, I kind of grew a little, I want to say a little depressed. I'm like, oh, some, some of my clients are just taking their signings now because, well, I get it. Like they need to improve their numbers or whatever. I get it. But then I'm like, what happens to me and my business? So I, that's what happened. I grew a little depressed and I started looking into something else. And that's where I got a full-time job in an investment firm. And it was honestly, it was a great job to take at the time because of the experience that I gained and how I saw them escalate and grill their business and how they prospect and everything. It just really, I've learned so much throughout the last months and really the importance of having IRAs and saving up for retirement. So it was just a really good experience and I'm very thankful for it. And I, I am a full believer that everything happens for a reason and that God uses us and places us where we're supposed to be to mold us and shape us and so that's what I had to do at the time and that's what I did and that's fine and when people tell you your mindset has everything to do with your business it is 100% true if your mindset isn't there your business is not going to grow your mindset has to be in a positive really good you have to have a good perspective of things Otherwise, it's going to be very hard. There's always going to be highs and lows. Always. Like, I felt so ashamed to show you my numbers after just being high, high, high all the time. And then I took a couple dips. And I was so ashamed of that. And I'm like, why? A business is never going to be like this. Just like the economy. It's never been like this. The economy has its dips and then it goes up. The same will happen to our businesses because our businesses move along with the economy. Sometimes you'll have amazing numbers in the month and sometimes not so great and that's okay. It's not the end of the world that I made $3,000 one month and I made $10,000 the next. Like it's just, it's balance. It's called life. It has ups and it has downs. I don't know if you are part of the loan signing system, but if you're not, you should be. What are you waiting for? We did have a conference back in August. I was in the live stream of it. Last year I was in there in person and I wanna go back next year, but this year I did the live stream and gosh, it was amazing. The things that I learned and I started implementing in my business have really shaped and really changed my business. Um, I don't know if you saw, but my favorite one was the seven figure signing agent panel wow that's where i realized like what are you doing you lisa like you can't expect to just market to 10 people and market to those same 10 people over and over and over and over and expect your business to boom like these seven figure signing agents have thousands of leads and prospects on their crm systems and i'm yet here i am with a t like a spreadsheet of 15 people trying to market to the same 15 people and i gotta think bigger i gotta think outside the box and that's what i started doing i started hitting up my realtors and my lenders i've become friends with a lot of them which is so cool because at the end of the day, that's the people that I want to hang out because people you surround yourself is who you end up becoming. And I just want, I want to have that sort of mentality and mindset that they have. A lot of them are amazing givers to the community and they have these amazing charities that they're part of and they help a lot. And I'm like, I want to do that. I want to be part of that. Anyways, I just needed to shift my perspective and don't get me wrong, it's not all rainbows and butterflies. Sometimes I still stress out and I still cry and we still have bad days and we still have good days, but let those good days outweigh the bad days. I have, this past four months have for sure gotten way more signings and work. And because I was at a job, I couldn't take a lot of it and so I did, Obviously, my signing service was there for me. 
Um, but I think it's time to go back to full time and I'm really excited to film. I do want to, and I would like your opinion on this. I do want to give you more than just notary business, like more business entrepreneur, more of the backside and the administrative work and the, I don't know, more behind the scenes of the business, more days in the life, more vlogs about the business, but also just share a little bit more about me. I I feel like, I don't know, like, like it's very professional in business and I obviously want to keep that because I know that's what you're here for, but I also want to give you some other stuff. So we'll see, we'll see how I figure that out. I don't know. I do have another YouTube channel. I haven't posted in there in a while, but I was going to make it in my blog channel and I'm like, I don't know, should I keep them separate? Should I keep them all together? Obviously still keep it very business um theme so you'll see a lot more from me and i'm so excited i've missed you guys i've missed being on tiktok i've missed being on instagram and just sharing my tips and tricks and how my day has been and the work that i have obviously now with the interest rates the interest rate rates are still pretty high but it's become our normal and people are not stopping now to buy a home like they were a couple months back or even last year thinking like it's gonna go down it's gonna go down they're just buying a home and then eventually will refinance when the interest rates do go down and so i feel like that like the interest rates have become a new norm and that's just made the market kind of boom a lot more i've seen a lot of my realtors and lenders talk about how there have been um they're having bids again like a bid war on homes and everything and homes are literally not staying on the market we had one for i think a million dollars and it only lasted like not even a week and so that's a good sign the business is booming and i'm so excited i'll bring more content of me like going to open houses and just going out to, to these events i do have Oh, that reminds me. I do have a come wine with me this Thursday, which I do really want to um, have it on my calendar. And I really want to go to. So, yeah, just give you a little bit more behind the scenes of everything. I also implemented a new system. Like, I implemented a CRM system for my business. So, I can give you more information on that and how it works and what I do and what I use it for. I also, um, Google Calendar is my best friend now. If it's not on my calendar, then it's not i'm not going to remember it and i'm not going to do it so everything goes on my calendar and my planner um so yeah that's just what we've been up to what we've been doing and so i'm really excited to bring you guys along with me um revamping my entire business i am hopefully next week we'll have my business um uh, my website up and running again i've just been working on it for a while not liking how it looked and I just need to finish it. I did have a photo shoot recently and I'm so excited with the pictures and how they turned out. I'm getting new business cards and new marketed just in time for like the holidays and everything. I'm getting new marketing materials. Um, I already bought my Halloween marketing stuff. So you'll see that video coming soon. Um, and I also have a Thanksgiving one coming soon. So I'm so excited for the, all the content that is coming your way. I hope you like this video. If you did like my video, please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a single video. A lot is going to be coming your way. A lot of fun, informative, and helpful videos um, are going to be coming your way. So you don't want to miss those. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all the love on my videos. I truly, truly appreciate it. I do try and really read through all your dms and comments and messages and emails i appreciate you guys i hope you have a blessed day bye guys